Look around you. Look around you. Look around you. If you happen to find yourself in suburban Connecticut, you may spot this flower in a nearby garden or field. Echinacea purpurea, commonly known as the purple cone flower, is a common sight in many a garden throughout the eastern United States. It is native to the region, though truly wild patches are rare to see. It resides in the Asteraceae family, with notable relatives including the noble sunflower, the common dandelion, and the black-eyed Suzanne. The black-eyed Suzanne, in particular, also shares the genus Echinacea. This flower can live in USDA hardiness zones 3 through 8, which extend over most of the continental United States. It prefers soil that is well-drained and medium to dry. It also enjoys quite a bit of sunlight and a good pollinating insect population nearby. This flower is also slightly unique in terms of its reproduction. Rather than the usual set of pistil and stamen, the Echinacea purpurea's center cone is composed of hundreds of disc flowers and receptacle bracts. Each of these, once pollinated, develop into individual seeds that can be carried by birds or other small animals. This flower's other notable feature is its medicinal use. To demonstrate and explain this, we have enlisted the help of Quinton Flower S.D.O.T.S. This flower was used by the Native Americans as medicine as far back as the 1700s, uh, and extracts of it are still being produced and used to this day in forms such as this, uh, as, a, as a supplement that you can buy online. In its original form, it was the, the stems were chewed as an aid for the common cold and for sore throats. Uh, when European settlers arrived in the Americas, it was taken back with them to Europe, and they, they analyzed it, and they never could find an active ingredient. However, they did find that it does work as a minor immunostimulant. Thank you for your input. As you have seen, the Echinacea purpurea is a rather interesting wildflower. I hope you have enjoyed your time with us, and remember to always look around you.